Well, I think actually, if I think about for me, um, the kind of pressing questions that one asks and whether they have a practical application or a high level artistic application are basically at the heart of what it means to be human. And so when I teach, I realize that what I teach my students to do is to ask questions, not to master facts, but to sort of follow the leads of things that make them curious. Because if I can get them interested in learning about things as a larger set of the sort of human project or how I think of what the humanities do, then I can teach them to think about their worlds, to make better worlds, to make sense of themselves, their families, um, and the places that they operate. So for me, the humanities not only have a sort of profound sense of getting at what a human project has been for as long as one wants to identify or understand such a thing, but also kind of immediate things about what it means to be alive at this particular moment in this particular time and to operate in you know the sort of what ecosystems of our society so it goes from the most sort of high level and abstract to in a funny way the most practical kinds of things about how you get up in the morning and get through your day so i guess for me it's sort of from art to ethics I teach a lot of people who become teachers, and I'm really proud of my students. They teach middle school, they teach high school, some of them teach grade school, and sometimes I think that my job, people say, what have you contributed to the state of New Jersey? And I always want to say, we contribute your teachers. You know, we don't, we're not going to go cure your diseases, but we're going to contribute your teachers, which seems to me a most, a totally concrete and wonderful thing. I know lots of historians who've become lawyers. I know historians who've become doctors. Um, but I also know that history works as a discipline, which um, in a really wonderful way, I'm going to say something really nerdy here. Um, we try to teach undergraduates to move through a curriculum. And a well-structured curriculum gets you, by the time you're a senior or an advanced student, to begin to ask your own questions which means you've mastered a set of material, you've mastered a set of approaches, and then you're gonna to learn to make something up that pushes it in a new direction.